Hey, what's up guys? Millskull here. Welcome back to Space Engineers, episode 63. When we left off, we rolled uh, the Argamas Sublime down a hill. It's pretty fun. Uh, good times. No, not the Argamas Sublime. We did the drone. The drone rolled down a hill. Uh, that one's still okay. So yeah, this guy decided to tumble. Um, I hope it had a lot of fun going down there because, yeah, it, lose, it used up a lot of time. Now I'm waving at nobody. Let's pull out the welder. Uh, also, I think we got all of our thrusters right now done. Which is pretty cool. Um, man oh man, I'm so happy it's done. Yeah, all of our current thrust thrusters are done. Uh, I think all of our ions are done. All the ones we're going to do anyway. Uh, we might put a few more on the back. I don't know. I'm thinking I might just want to go with a couple more hydrogen. Uh, let's see. Let's get some hydrogen thrusters here. Big ones. Now, do I want to put two more here? Is that overkill? It might not be. I mean, there's only... The back's going to look kind of weak. Come on now. Right there. Right? Should we do that? Oh, I wish we... You know what? We can. Um, I need to... Integrate at least one more thruster down here. Let's see. How would I go about doing this? I just want to get uh, some more hydrogen thrusters back here. So we'll probably do two. And then we'll put one down here. Um, I guess the easy way would be to convey it. So let's go conveyor junction. Gimme. Uh, conveyor curve tube and a regular tube. Right? Okay. That'll work. So let's go number eight. Something like this. Interior plates. Don't worry, I'm not gonna go overboard. I might go a little overboard on the back ion thrusters. Um, because the one thing we do want is the ability to get away from whatever we're trying to get away from. Uh, interior plates. Where are you? Int plates. That's good enough. So let's pipe this up real quick. We'll go one here. Looks good. One here. Looks good. And then let's call it... Let's center it up here. So let's see. Scoo back. Scoo back a bit, Muley. It's that weird glitch thing again. Let's go right here. Oh, is it offset? No. I'm I'm looking at it weird. Am I? Does that look? Why does that look so weird for some reason? Hold on. That looks okay. I think I can live with this. Yeah, I think I'm just looking at it wrong. Um, also... Before I do that... Uh, yeah. You guys saw what I saw. I had a glitch there, but yeah, it's good. It's good. So like this. Um, give you all the interior plates I can muster. Let's get some metal grids too. Do I have them all in the drone? Ah, let's let's get piping first. Hold on. I'm gonna run. Oh, that's good. That's good. That's good. One more up. You're good. And you're good. Oh, you need 50 grids. Okay. So let's go get 50 grids real quick. Or just as many as I can carry and then we'll kind of play around a bit. Uh, we'll get that and the piping done. So, let's just go like this. Okay. I'm not going to do the piping by hand. I'm just going to get it set up and then our welder can do the rest. 
but I do want to make sure whatever is getting piped below it is done. So like these grids, like there's a few spots in here that don't have uh, grids. I know this one. Yeah, see. So this one's not done. This one's not done. There's a few like that. Okay. Um. Let's see here. Straight pipe. You. You. I did this totally weird, didn't I? Okay. I meant to go something like this, because I was going to conjoin them. Like this. And then, conveyor here. Oh, no, 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 no. I was doing it right. I was doing it right all along. Uh, that, this is this is necessary, isn't it? Okay. Because I was gonna put a thruster there, and a thruster there, and a thruster there. Those are hydrogen, though. So we'll we'll worry about uh, other ones later. Okay. Flip. Oh wait, I need to do it this way. There we go. Looking at the wrong thing. Jeez, Mealy. Man. Making it harder than it has to be. Okay. Um, yeah. Let's go get some steel real quick. Good enough. Large hydrogen thruster. Right here. Right here. And right here. Overkill? Maybe. But look at how much it fills it out. It makes it look better. Um... I mean, they're not necessary, obviously, but, you know, you're moving away. What are you? Military escort. Okay, yeah, you can move away. Let's go like this. Let's type in ion. Let's grab some large ion thrusters. Um, yeah, let's grab a few. We'll do it here. We'll kind of fill in the in-betweens a bit. So, I'm going to go here. I don't want them to be exactly lined up with the one above it. So we'll put that there like that. Put this one here in the same type of place. Come on now. Jeez. Like that, right? Right. And then, uh... Maybe we'll do one more up here. Because, yeah, you know, the back of the ship has to have the most power. Uh, more for escape maneuvers and stuff like that, because when it's time to get out, it's time to get out. Then just for the fun of it, uh, what should we put on that? We have something for a conveyor, but... Um, hmm... Gosh, I don't know. You know what? A rear Gatling... T well, no, I can't do that. Interior turret, no. Um, this launcher is 3x3, three three, isn't it? Yeah, it's big. Yep, that won't fit. Interior turret. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna. That'd be too weird for me. Okay, so, uh, there's that. That's gonna be a fun thing to weld in here, oh boy. Think I can get to that? I don't think so. I think I'm gonna have to do some hand welding in here, but we'll get what we can. Um, and yeah, just start going for it. Sure, yeah. Like this. 
Good job, Muley. Oh man, look at you go. Such a weldy welder. Okay, good enough for me. Um, let's plan out some gyroscopes. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna mess around right now. Uh, where am I at on hydrogen and oxygen? I'm good. On, I'm good on both for a second. While I come down here, take a look at this. How are you doing, Mr. Battery? You're depleting. Kind of a given. 190 days. I th I think we'll be okay for a minute. Uh, let's get some gyroscopes started. How many gyroscopes will Muley <laughs> Muley use today? Um, I'm just using the drone bike to store things now. I'm not even messing with the with the other stuff. Actually, what I should do is grab these. Go do a few of these back plates because now that I'm thinking about it, it's going to be kind of hard to reach them. Um, I know that like some of these are going to be impossible to reach at some point. You don't have any. You don't have any. Okay, you're good. Now, I I have a feeling that there's going to be a few that I that just aren't going to get. Yeah, it's kind of unsettling to me. It bugs me because then it's not. I don't know. Should I worry about it? They look complete. I don't like the fact that they aren't. Can I reach it? Um, actually, I can reach most of this back wall. Well, kind of reach this back wall from here. I don't know. I think I should have finished that because I, I didn't think about it. Anyway, we'll be okay. I know, I know. Bad melee, bad engineer. Um, we need to do gyroscopes. So, I'm going to take this down. And I'm going to take this down. And I'm actually going to just replace them. Somewhere over here. Like, this looks like a fine location for some of these. Uh, you can go there for now. You can go there for now. But you're gonna cast shadows. That's okay with me for now. I just want to get a clear look at this. I think if I run one row... Ah, steel plates. Let's see. Now I'm thinking I'm just gonna run one row of each right here. Something like this. Just two things that go from there to there. Right here. This will be where we'll put our gyroscopes on the bottom of this. On each window. Because it'd be cool to see them, but I don't want them to take up a lot of space. And this already takes up two blocks worth of space for gyroscopes, you know. And we're not going to put them all, like, we're not going to fill this with gyroscopes even though it sounds really cool I think that if we space them by one like we place one skip one place one skip one it'll be fine so this goes there let's put it here um, I want them to face the same way so keypad let's uh put the keypad towards the inside that's on the first, last, okay. So like that. Like this. Keypad towards the inside. Skip. That one placed the same way? I don't think it did. 
Ah. Let's do it from here. Keypad. 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 Okay, I was pressing T, but it's not doing it. That's fine. Now, hopefully, this is a number that ends. It's an odd number, I hope. It's, nah, it's not. That's alright. That's alright. We can live with that. So there's a row of gyroscopes, and that's probably overkill, but hey. I don't I don't mind that. Um like this. And this amount of gyroscopes in this small ship should handle anything we attach to it or put on it. Um because it's a lot of gyroscopes. Because this ship isn't that big. It's it's going to have a pretty big living area, I think. Um, which is going to be in our next phase, hopefully. Um, we're just getting all of the systems taken care of. Uh, we haven't done, like, exterior things, like... Solar panel, solar panels, oxygen farms. Um, oh, what else? Hangar bay. I think the hangar bay is actually going to go on top of this. Like this is going to be the hangar, and it kind of bugs me that there's thrusters right here, but we're going to be up a bit, you know. We should be all right. What do I have on me? A lot of iron. Or steel. Okay, so there's that. Now. Now I'm thinking. Kind of want this to be reinforced in a sense. So. We go. All blocks. Let's go heavy armor. Right there, number six. Uh, we go like this, and then every couple, hold on, where are we? Hmm, come on computer, keep up. I just have, okay. Let's get some of these out of the way. I want to move this one and you know what I I'm gonna it's fine it's fine guys okay don't worry don't worry I'll pick it up promise okay pinky swear I didn't even put it in the right spot I'll pick it up okay just just bear with me here I'm in the... I'm, I'm building, okay? I can't worry about a couple of those things. One, two, three. On the fourth one. One, two, three. Did I do that again? No, okay, I'm on the right spot. I know, I'm making a big mess. Things are rolling all over the place. Really, this is why we go on mining trips all the time, okay? Hey, you guys gotta admit, I'm pretty clean about things. Three. One, two, three. Do it here. Okay. I mean, as far as space engineers go, I, I haven't really dropped a lot of things. Well, except for an entire three mining ships. Or two mining sh No? One? What number are you? Ah, oh, whatever. So like that. Um, and this one will be light armor. These will all be light armor. Uh, maybe we'll put some windows in. I don't know. I kind of want to close it off and make this a hangar, so... We aren't gonna... Yeah. Oh, okay. I'm kind of torn. Because I want to keep building. But I don't want to drop too many things on the ground, because... 
Cause yeah, it's it's not it's not good to throw materials around, make a big mess. There we go. Okay, and these will be closed off too. But I'm gonna actually, um, yeah, I'm just gonna do this. I'm gonna clear my inventory so I can pick that stuff up. Whoa. Whoa. Look at that. This is heavy. Okay, fine. There. Wow, that actually did quite a bit. Let's get down here and pick these things up. I think that's everything. I mean, better be everything. Right? Inventory, inventory full. Yeah, yeah. Why aren't you moving? Shouldn't this all be hooked up? I still don't get it. Whatever. All right. up the rest of that junk. Good? Good. Oh, nope. Okay. So we got that. Um, let's clear these out too, because, yeah. I'm pretty dead set on making a hangar today. Or at least the deck for it. Uh, which we'll probably have to explore extend actually now that I'm thinking about it. We'll have to be out a bit. Maybe we will... Should we run a row of reinforced there? Probably. Gosh, this ship is getting taller and taller and taller every time I look at it. Like, I probably didn't need a, a row of that, but I mean, okay, just, just bear with me here. Take a look at this. When you're looking up, you, you kind of want it to feel like... I think I want it to feel like there's just row after row after row of... systems, you know what I mean? So you're down here. I wish that I had the foresight to make that... Uh, partially glass. So that you could look up and see through all of the decks. I think that would have been really cool. Um, is it possible? Probably. I could probably do it in a few spots. I could probably do this whole row here in glass. And this one also. Um, I don't know. It might happen. Tell me what you guys think. Because that's kind of what I would like. I, and you know what? It's May 1st today, by the way. Uh, actually, it's May... Let me check. 2nd. 1 a.m. I missed... My deadline. I really, really, really wanted to get this thing launched by May 1st. It just didn't happen. I had a plumbing issue. I had, like, oh, I was under my house all day fixing plumbing uh, Saturday. So, I'm sorry. <laughs> now, what did I do? I grabbed a whole bunch of steel plates. Why did I do that? Okay. I don't know. There's no excuse. Now, I hope I'm not missing anything, because I just found those computers. And I swear I got everything else. We should do some weldy welding. But I know these things take a butt ton of steel, so we might as well just do this. It's uh, 600 per on steel. Steel plates. Oh, I was going to pick these up. 
and we'll get a few of them down. We'll get these two down. I mean, it's a slow charge, but it's a charge, right? We'll put them over here. get these moved out of the way too. There we are. There we go. Beautiful. Um, what is this? This is a oxygen tank. Uh, do I need access to all of these? No. So I think I'm just going to have this one come up. Now, I've originally, I thought maybe I should come up through there. Uh, I think I'm going to leave that as an access for this deck. This one will have come straight up. This will be kind of the lifeline of the ship. I don't have the tubes for that to work, but um, we will have two. We'll have one here and one there. And those will just go straight up. And yeah, that'll be okay. Actually, you know what? I don't think I want this one because I might want a door here. This will just be a s little room. It's not going to have anything. It's just going to be a place to uh, maintain these gyroscopes if we need to. And I think that's okay. So let's do that. We'll put a little door here. We'll seal this one off. Um, Man, I hate it when it does that. So that one's sealed off, and then we'll have this one sealed off. Because they should all do the same thing, right? They're all hooked to the same system. Why? Why? You know what? Since you're acting up, I'm going to do this. Okay, just making sure. <laughs> You go up, you go up. Perfect. Okay. Yeah. That's good. Uh, that is our... Gyroscope... Room. Maybe we'll put some windows here on the outside, too. I don't know. I kind of want windows. I do want windows. I want this thing to... But down here, it doesn't really need windows, so... The good thing about having this deck here, which I think I'm going to extend this out to, um, this isn't permanent right here. This is going to go up. Uh, the good thing about having this deck here though, like just having this go here, like this is all going to be ceiling, uh, is we can actually encase these and I don't have to worry about anything fancy going right over them. And we'll have that little gap above them where it would actually be cool if we could run catwalks along these, just like on this row, just run them straight across uh, for maintenance. I think that'd be pretty sweet, but it's going to start bottlenecking as, as soon as I get past it. It's going to go, it's, it's going to pinpoint somewhere. I just don't know yet. But yeah, this is actually just going to go out. And it's cool because we can actually extend the front a bit too. For ramming purposes. <laughs> Not really. So yeah. There's that. And that will... Yeah. It'll get us farther away from these thrusters too. So we're actually up two rows. And park the ships here.
We'll have to convey this somehow. What do we have below? Um. Tell you what, I could actually run a conveyor up from that one down there if I take this thruster out, which I think I might. Yeah, we'll run a conveyor up from the back, and that will... Actually, you know what? That could take up the middle right here. So we'll bring it up, we'll bring it in here, and then we'll poke holes in this uh, to set up connectors for the ships to connect to. That would be pretty sweet. I think that'd work really good. Only downfall is they're in the middle, which means that the ships will be parked to one side or the other unless I park them. Well, you know what? All my conveyors are, all my connectors are sideways, right? I think the drone's the only one that would be parked kind of weird, but we can make a special place for that. Yeah, okay, so we can actually have the conveyors come up and over and just have it on the side like this and then park this facing outside the door if you follow me. So these will be parked horizontally with the ship uh, towards the blast door. It's gonna work great. What about you Spoon? You're a funky one too. I didn't think about you. We might have to do something about your connector. Um, we could just face it backwards. Or maybe... Uh, yeah, oh, man, this thing. One oxygen tank. You have two. You don't really need to, but I just love the look of you. You're... You're, like... Gosh, this is the best ship. I'm sorry. We don't need to change it. Never change, Spoon. Be yourself. So yeah, guys, I'm starting to ramble. Um, should I do some welding? Hmm, 30 minutes in? Why not? You guys love it when I go past 30 minutes anyway. Alright, um, here. Let's go... Control panel. Remote control. Control to thrusters on, batteries on recharge. That's my nine key. So I'm going to hit P and hope it turns off. Okay. I can't be too careful right now. Uh, we have some things. Can I? access anything. Oh no, wait. I'm not even hooked up. <laughs> I'm playing with my inventory sitting over there. Good job, Muley. What do we got on us? Got a couple thruster components. Uh, my main goal right now is actually to get these gyroscopes done because we have control of the ship. We need it to be more functional as far as control goes. Which is where these babies come in handy. Now here's a fun fact. That weld I just did was 1200 steel plates. So I can't do too many more of those. I guess I, I can, but you know what I mean. These ones will get done. One of these won't get done. Really? Okay, yeah, one of those isn't done. So there's that. What do we got left? Uh, thruster components. Okay, let's just weld what we can. Do this one. I do have metal grids, though, so you know what? I should hit this back wall if I can. As much as possible, anyway. Alright, um, you. I got nothing for you. Let's see. Mm. 
All right, I'm out of steel plates, which is kind of what we're using right now. So let's actually just go like this. Production of the static grid. Production. Um, yes, please. Actually, I should be doing that by the thousands. 20,000. <laughs> 20, yeah, that's a lot. Holy crap. Good enough. Okay. Uh, I like steel plates. I can't complain about that. It's my favorite component. Um, we're running a little light. Hmm. It takes this kind of stuff. I guess I could just weld what I can on the... Still we can on these gyroscopes. Oh, you know what? I have... How many? It's 960 per. Let's do 3,000. How many do I have down here? Two. Okay, and there's going to be a third and a fourth one probably, so I should just queue up another one. Come on now. There we go. I'm getting those ready to go. <laughs> so, yeah, they'll be ready. Yeah, let's do what we can here. I mean, it's not going to be a lot because I'm not starting with uh, steel plates, but I'm just going to run the welders across them. I should use up what I can on these. Oh, what's that sound? Bump something. Whatever. Okay. Did that do anything or was I just pretending? I think I was pretending, guys. Still got some metal grids, which we'll need more of because these are 50 per? Something like that. It's a lot. A lot of grids. get fully up like this. There we go. Oh, come on now. What are you doing? There we go. Oh, come on. Keep hitting S and not C. Doesn't look like it, but it's doing something. Not a lot, but I think I'm out of grids. I've been out of grids, so. Okay. That's all I can do. Didn't use any motors or computers on any of that, did I? Whatever. Let's go park it. Let's take a look. Come on. Fingers, work with me here. There we go. Oh, come on now. Alright, I want to go check these gyros. Because I don't think it was doing anything to, like, this side. Maybe it was, but... Oh yeah, did grids, and motors and computers, that's decent. And I queued up a lot of steel plates, but uh, just look at it this way. Let's see, this, this, that's 6, 12, 18, 24, 6, 12, 18, 24, 30, 3600 between that whatever I counted there. 3,600 steel plates. This is 25. So, that was 36. Let's count by four. One, two, three, four. That's 37. 
One, two, three, four. Thirty-eight. Thirty-nine. Forty. Forty-one. Forty-one fifty. Um. Forty two fifty. Let's call it forty three. Ah, forty three. Two three four five six. It's uh forty four fifty. Let's see. Forty five. Forty six. So yeah, I mean that's forty six hundred plates ish plus the whatever I didn't count there this is I'm roughly <laughs> estimating I'm trying to be as accurate as I can but that's 4,000 plus plates there um, also we have how tall is this thing now from here we'll go one two three four five six Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven by. I mean, I'm just getting a square. Let's square it up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine. It's forty. Wow, that's amazing. Forty from nose to back. So 40 times 11, if I were to make this a box, is a lot of steel. Someone figure that out. It's uh, 40, let's see, 40 by 11, that's 440 square feet on one side times 2 would be 880. 880 blocks to make it square. Now we have a cutout here. It's, uh, yeah. So we get a minus half of us, yeah, whatever that is. Um, we get to come out a bit. So that makes up for that cutout. That's a lot. That's a lot of plates. Okay, I'm rambling about mass. It's like almost 1.30 in the morning. I love you guys. Uh, I want to thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. I hope you enjoyed uh, Muley's random mind math lesson. Leave me a like, comment, favorite, subscribe. Hey, you look, you look into that camera, Muley. Look into it. Okay, that was a bad idea. Um, yeah, thank you all for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!